If you don't know how to thread your needle, you're going to take string. I took about my arm's length of a string, and you're going to thread it to through the eye. Oh, where's the camera? Through the eye of the needle. Okay, like that. You're going to thread it through, and then pull so that you meet the two sides of the thread together. And you're going to tie a knot, a knot at the end of the thread. I would do two knots for safekeeping on top of one another so it just makes one bigger knot. Sometimes you don't get it right away. There we go. So, a knot. And we have our thread. So the first pieces that we're going to sew together is we're going to take one of our sides and the bottom of our mole and we are going to match up the pattern sides together like so so that the feet are facing one another in the back and the front and we are going to just sew along the line that we drew so starting at we can start at the, the, the front, it doesn't really matter which side you start at, but you start at the front and we're going to put our needle through and pull tight and to sew, all you do is you take your needle and you go through the fabric, pull, and then through the fabric, just going down the line. Okay. Just continuing down the line until you get to the other side. Okay, just like so. So you're eventually going to get some stitches that will look like this. You're going to go all the way down, tracing just just along the bottom of our mole, so up to here. So take a moment and do that yourself. Okay, once you have sewn the bottom part of your first side to the bottom of your mole, to tie off the string, the best way that I've learned how to do it is when you get to the end, you make a little, you stitch kind of through the fabric again, but on the same side, and you put your needle through the loop. Okay, so again, you put your needle through the fabric so it comes back out on the same side. Okay, like so. And your fabric will make a little loop, or your string, my apologies, my string, will make a loop, and I'm going to put my needle through the loop and pull, and it will make a dot. So you can tie, tie that, cut this off. Okay, we have the one side sewn, so if we open it up, it's sealed. So what you're going to do now is you're going to flip your fabric inside out like so or the right side out and take your other piece other side of your fabric and you're going to place it along the bottom of your mole again okay so the other side of the bottom of your mole you're going to place it okay so like so we're going to sew along the other side of the bottom. This is putting the two sides, um, attaching them to the bottom of our mole, the, the, the belly of our mole. So you will have to put some more thread on your needle. And then once again, same thing, starting from the front of our mole, just follow the line and sew all the way to the back and tie off our string again. So take a moment and do that. Alright, so at this point we have sewed, sewn both sides of our mole to the bottom of our mole. So we're getting pretty close to being done, so we have stitches on the bottom. A little suggestion, the smaller the stitches you make, the more secure your mole will be. So my stitches are kind of big over here, but starting on this side I used smaller stitches. So I suggest using smaller stitches, but that's um, a preference. So what we're going to do now is we're going to sew the top of the mole together. Starting at the front of the mole, okay, start at the front of the mole. We are going to sew around the hump, around the back of the mole, but we are going to stop about right here, okay, so we can mark that. We're going to stop sewing about right there and tie off our string. So you're going to need a needle and thread again, and you're going to sew from the front of the mole all the way to about two inches, maybe three, before the back of our mole because we need a little space so we can flip our mole right side out and then we will stuff our mole and then continue sewing it shut. So we'll get there in a moment. So still being flipped inside out, so from the front all the way to about two, three inches before the back. 
take a moment and do that. All right, we're almost done here. So once you have sewn the top, see how I stopped about an inch or two right before the back of our mole? We have now sewn all sides of our mole together, right? So what we're going to do is we're going to, using the little hole that we still haven't sewn shut, we're going to flip our mole right side out so that our fabric shows. We're going to flip it out. Looks like a glob right now, but just wait. Okay, get the front side of our mole. You know, flip it inside out, find the feet, flip those right side out. All right. So here we have our right side out mole. So there's the front, there's the face. There's the little feet in the back, but this is pretty flat, and so we need to stuff our mole. What you can get from a store is stuffing. Okay, it looks like this, the bag of stuffing, okay, fluff. You get it from Joanne. It's just soft craft, soft craft, polyfill. So you can get a clunk of stuffing.